Hey, what's up you guys? So in my last video, I told you guys to leave some comments down below for questions you have for me. So this is a Q&A video and I thought I'd answer them. The first question comes from Justin Sun and it says, How do you get your crush to notice you? Whenever I try to talk to my crush, I just end up mumbling. <laughs> well, Justin, I think the best thing you can do is just take a deep breath, stay calm, and talk to them like you're talking to a normal person. I mean, just because you're trying to have romantic relationships with them doesn't mean that you're not trying to be their friend. And don't try and overanalyze what you're saying. Just remember that analysis is paralysis. Okay, so this next question comes from Sean Kelker and it says, How does it feel to have food poisoning from the raw hot dog you ate? Well, Sean, I learned from a friend that hot dogs are already cooked when you buy them, so it's actually completely safe for me to eat. I just don't really like the taste of hot dogs, I guess, and the fact that it was cold didn't make it any better. So this next question comes from Zach Sheba, and he said, Spencer, what's your favorite anime? Well, I think, I mean, out of all the animes, there's a ton in the world, but I think my favorite has to be Cory in the House. Nickelodeon really nailed their anime with Cory in the House, and it's just so good. I think it can, like, I think just anyone can find their inspiration from Cory in the House. It's just great, and it has really good moral lessons. Alyssa Moreno commented, what is your most rewarding moment as a YouTube sensation? Well, being such a big YouTuber, I would have to say that posting a new video and just seeing all the comments from all my fans just really motivates me to keep going with it. And I love all you guys, I love all my fans with all my heart, so thank you for that. This next question from Kyle said, how can I learn about your life in a fun and easy way? Well Kyle, you're in luck, because on my YouTube channel, I will be posting weekly vlogs that will update you on my life and hopefully entertain you guys. Christine Osborne commented saying that I was her inspiration, and she just wondered where I get my inspiration from. Um, there's a lot of things that inspire me in the world, but I think if I had to say one, it's definitely Nicki Minaj. Just her confidence and her overall ability and talent is what really inspires me, and I think not only as a YouTuber, but as a person, she's my strive. Alyssa Moreno commented again, when did I know I was destined to be a YouTube icon? Well, I think some people are just at birth, destined to be a star, and I guess you could say that's me. Grayson Gardner asked, if I could be one mystical animal, what would I be and why? Well, this one didn't really take that much thought. I already knew that I want to be Nicki Minaj's butt. I mean, some of you guys might say in the comments, oh, Nicki Minaj's butt isn't a mystical animal. But, I mean, if you just look at the, the size of it, just the size of it alone, uh, I think that thing's pretty sacred to me, and I would love to be it. <laughs> Shaden Bodemar asked, what on God's green earth is wrong with your face? You know, it's like a really serious diagnosis that I have. Uh, yeah, I can't really control it or anything. What it is, is it's resting bitch face. And, you know, I really just hope that some of you guys will appreciate me for my content and what I am as a person instead of just my face. Thank you guys. Alyssa Moreno commented yet again, if I'm gonna be doing any collabs with other people in the future. Alyssa, I don't really want to spoil anything, but I think one of my next videos will be a collab. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe down below. Also, if you have any other questions, please don't hesitate to ask them in the comment section down below, and I'll see you guys next time.